Hi, Bhavish. Yeah, good afternoon, ma'am. Good afternoon. Sorry for keeping you waiting. Uh, uh, no issues, ma'am. How are you doing? Yeah, fine, ma'am. Great. And firstly, congratulations. Yeah, thank you. You've, uh, made all of us proud. And um, yes. how are you feeling? You tell me that. Better, ma'am. It was a relief after twenty-two months, and I hope you remember that uh, in uh, before that June attempt, uh, you had a Q and A session. I was also there in that session, and uh, I was desperate about uh, uh, the June attempt, twenty twenty-three. And you said it is not possible because you are not prepared. So uh, I'll aim for that December twenty-twenty-three, uh, and I failed June and December as well. So mm-hmm. I was quite uh, desperate and uh, nervous about this one attempt, but thankfully it was done. Although the target was JRF, but somehow it is done. See, next we are to up JRF. The ka safar bahut asaan hai because you already know the basics. You know ninety percent. You just need to have that cherry on the top, and JRF will be done. Yeah. So, yes. firstly, uh, since this video is going to go on uh, YouTube, a lot of people are going to uh, watch this. So they want to first. Um, it would be great if you can first introduce yourself. कहाँ से हैं आप? What are you doing? Uh, your graduation, post graduation journey. Yes. Also, I think there's some lag in sure. the network. So just try to um, you know squeeze the video so that. Um, Uh, you know, if you can just divide the video or open it in, um, uh, in a minimized format. So in that case, the network issue will be sorted. I think it is better now. Okay, this one you are seeing original yes. issue. Yes, yes, I I think okay. this is better. Yeah. Well. Okay, so uh, ma'am, as you know, I am Bhavesh Gohera, and I am basically from Gwalior, Madhya Pradesh, and uh, I have been teaching English since two thousand eighteen. So I have had my connection with English literature and English, and uh, I started my graduation in two thousand eighteen, and uh, for the four years, I had decided that I will never go for any competitive exam from two thousand eighteen to New Year two thousand twenty three. I have told everyone that I will never do any any exam. Means wherever there are more people, I will never go. It can be NET, SAT, etc. People had told me even in my first year that one day you will have to go for NET. But because <laughs> I was uh, ambitious and you can say in that youth you want a startup, so I was enthusiastic for that startup. Uh, in twenty twenty three, I thought that. I need some stability, so I should go for uh, 2023. I decided to go for NET, and uh, as you know, that uh, year there were three attempts. Means usually there are two NET. That was unstable from my side, I guess. So in that year, 2023, it was three. So I appeared for March attempt without preparation. Uh, just you can say it was a wild guess, and I got 89 percentile by wild guess. So come. And it was far from that, a, a bit far from that. Then I uh, bought your course, purchased your course, and made notes. I still have that six registers in my uh, <laughs> book stack that you can see. So six registers I made, handwritten notes. Uh, then I paid for June attempt. I failed. Then December, and meanwhile my uh, startup and offline coachings they were going on. So it was quite uh, difficult to make time. Then I uh, made this attempt June twenty twenty four, and uh, I was again nervous and not sure that I'll crack it. And I, I was just going for December, but thankfully, uh, it happened. So this yes. is a brief introduction of mine. Oh, that's that's wonderful. So, what do you teach? Uh, English. English literature. I would teach uh, social Hindi and English, but uh, last year I started academic English uh, till class twelve. Oh, and wonderful. spoken English wonderful. too. So is it uh, is it CBSC um, like uh, the board that you are teaching? In academics, uh, uh, both both both. Okay. There is okay. a full batch of like uh, there is an institute, offline institute. I visit there. So there are eighty students, fifty uh, CBSC and thirty MP. So I teach literature to both, which is common now. And CRT is common. And writing right. portion is different, so I uh, teach accordingly. Okay, wonderful, accordingly. wonderful. 
great great so we both are same you are also a professor or teacher i'm also a professor or a teacher <laughs> so i'm i'm pretty sure that you must have applied those tips and tricks that you used to give to your students about revision and uh, practicing in your net journey as well yeah so uh, yes uh, yes ma'am uh, your trick Mm -hmm. uh that you said na revise on day 0 uh, day 7 and day 28 i have told my students also before board exam that uh, some great teacher has told me because i don't reveal names of people uh, uh-huh. so before board exam i uh, that that some great teacher has told me because i don't reveal names of people uh so i said that there is one great teacher who told me this and i am telling <laughs> you the same thing Yes. I I think the credit goes to the one who discovered the forgetting curve but then I think that really helps forgetting okay. curve is something that I always talk about in my videos ki teen revision agar aapne kar liya to aapki long term memory mein wo cheez chali gayi hai and for uh, an exam as uh, vast as english literature it is very important because so many characters so many novels are there so it is important ki wo sab kuch hamare dimag mein exam tak uh, rahe So tell me uh, that how did you manage your paper one and paper two ka preparation? Like were you allocating specific time on a daily basis? Yeah, paper one ko kab fir shuru kia panna? Sure, ma'am. So from the beginning, as everyone says that you have to manage paper one as well. You also said that uh, you have to go for paper one. Uh, you, I also watched your videos, which were made by your brother, I guess. Right, right. He's yes. your brother. Now you gave one example of his as well. Oh. So I watched that, and I subscribe to some other course also. There is one uh, teacher, for I'll not reveal the name. <laughs> He's also famous for paper one. And uh, actually, I prepared quite uh, offline and from different sources. For example, I also teach uh, part time at a school. So when I wanted, uh, I had some doubts of computer. So I went to the school teacher of computer. That ma'am, please tell me about this uh, decimal, etc. I I had some hmm. doubt in math, so I went to the math teacher who is also my friend. So in this way, <laughs> you had all paper one teachers, teachers around you. <laughs> around me, yeah. So that was quite free, of course, thing and uh, personal thing offline. Then I watched several uh, online videos, of course, for paper one, and uh, there are some famous books for that. So I did that. In paper two, of course, uh, majority of thing and five units were from your registers only. I try try to revise uh, revise that. and i guess in these uh, 22 months i have read uh, the register at least for five times and uh, every time i read i find it is something new in hindi we get na ki revise kar raha hu par sab kuch naya naya kyun lag raha hai so it happens yeah. that we forget and uh, when we read we realize that there is something uh, yeah. i also prepared for mpsc so uh, there were some topics common as i have mm-hmm. uh, i have cleared mp set in 2023 Uh, the course is almost the uh, same as you know so while i was preparing for mp set that also gave a boost to the preparation uh, i also gave that uh, mp psc assistant professor exam which was okay. on 9th of june uh, as you know and yeah thankfully that, that is also cleared and i am going for interview in uh, oh, this wow. january wonderful so that preparation that also helped helped thank you okay, so that also helped Wow, wonderful! So in, and in... Uh, yeah, PYQs as you always say. Mm-hmm. Yes, yes. Please go uh, ahead. So Habe. there is a book of uh, yes, there is a Arihant's book now which has a uh, ten years PYQs with explanation. So I also purchased that and uh, read some part of it. Okay, okay. Yeah, and uh, what about um, like when we talk about paper two? So, सबसे important areas क्या थे? Like, did you go chronologically or did you pick up a few units which you uh, prepared first? <laughs> okay, uh, as you always say, because I remember that June twenty twenty three, we had a session with you. So you told that there are some uh, important units. First is British, second is literary theory, literary criticism. American literature and uh, Indian literature. You said that less questions come. So of course, British was first. And uh, uh, my one, my senior, uh, there's my senior who told that uh, chapters after William Shakespeare are more important. So I focus less on that history part, that King Harold, etc. Focus more on that Christopher Marlowe and then William Shakespeare onwards. Uh, modern, I uh, did not study very much. I should have studied. I know. because we we see the wasteland when it comes to <laughs> you lose motivation so yeah. i have uh, prepared for british uh, theory and criticism i love that that was not a problem uh, in uh, american it was short so american literature i covered from notes only and uh, some pyqs 
and indian i have not studied much yet that thing yes so we okay. have i have focused and not uh, studied any six topic right right and literary theory kafi logo ko challenging lagta hai so when you went through my audios so samajh mein aa raha tha ya fir aisa laga ki nahi kahin aur se padhna hoga no 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 it uh, samajh mein aa gaya tha from the audio although audio is quite challenging and videos are better but i had <laughs> studied from audio and uh, the videos were provided later now there mm-hmm. are videos so it was comfortable right right so it was clear like you exact you explained using some example of lens ki aap kisi lens se dekh rahe hain that mm-hmm. was really good okay okay that's that's great um also um मतलब काफी बार ये बोला जाता है यूजीसी नेट पेपर टू का प्रिपरेशन में कि बैचलर्स मास्टर्स में जो पढ़ाया है अगर वो पढ़ लेते हो तो उससे क्लियर हो जाता है सो व्हाट इज योर टेक ऑन दैट बिल्कुल नहीं मैम इंग्लिश में तो नहीं है मैनेजमेंट में होता होगा एमबीए uh, में हो सकता है कॉमर्स में शायद होता हो बट इंग्लिश में आई डोंट थिंक कि ऐसा है बिल्कुल भी नहीं है बिकॉज इन बीए वी कैन से द सिलेबस इज वेरी लेस इट इज लाइक फोर यूनिट्स इन माय यूनिवर्सिटी आम कॉम्बी यूनिवर्सिटी which is quite famous university but still the syllabus is very limited you have four papers in each year right bhavish i think we lost you in the in middle bachelors. so okay. there are four okay. units bhavish, even can you, you have just uh, eight uh, or short sure, sure. yeah i i think you just have to repeat the last two lines we lost you in the middle sure Uh, yeah that, yes ma'am so as you said that uh, is it is b and ms labs in a for next i would say uh, not at all in management it can happen in commerce i it may happen but in uh, english literature it is not so the labs of b and ms is very limited in comparison to net in b in a ba we have only four papers per year in per paper we have 10 chapters and uh, it is understanding of our end professor that from each unit there are two writers and one we have to prepare detail <laughs> one we do not prepare so uh, i don't think that it can work not at all right right basically right. it can provide but not at all mm mm-hmm, mm mm-hmm. understood totally great so i think um, from what i have understood from you is that number one as you said that notes banana important hai because you uh, later revise those notes again and again uh, isme kahin ye lagta hai bhavesh ki agar uh, suppose let's say you you get the notes of uh, somebody else maybe koi senior ka ya kisi aur ka so kya usse bhi same preparation hoti hai you would have still said ki nahi mere khud ke hi notes hone chahiye uh ma'am iska uh... जवाब बहुत सिंपल है एक्चुअली यू नो आई हैव योर नोट्स एज आई साइड एंड दस माय क्लासमेट हु वर्क दैट नोट्स एंड ही हैज टोल्ड मी गिव मी द नोट्स आई विल गेट इट फोटोकॉपी सो टुडे टुडे सो व्हेन आई विल मीट हिम इन द इवनिंग आई विल टेल हिम द सेम थिंग दैट यू आर आस्किंग कि भाई आप कॉपी करवा भी लोगे सो व्हेन यू राइट यू लर्न इट बेटर आई गेस देयर इज सम लॉजिक इन टीचिंग एप्टीट्यूड आल्सो नो दैट व्हेन वी राइट वी रिमेंबर इट मोर एग्जैक्टली काइनेस्थेटिक लर्निंग राइट when you do things yeah, kind of study, yeah so then then you remember it uh, that is one thing secondly so according to me notes yes khud ke hi matlab jo mujhe bhi lagta hai ki aap jab koi cheez samajh ke apne shabdon mein likhte ho to wo sirf aap hi samajh sakte ho koi aur use pad ke usko lagega ye to kuch to likha hai but i cannot understand because aapne us time pe kya soch ke likha tha you only remember it came out of your brain so it's your brain child सो ये काफी सारे स्टूडेंट मुझसे पूछते हैं कि नहीं मैम नोट्स हम क्यों बनाए जैसे आई गिव पीडीएफ सब तो वीडियो लेक्चर्स के साथ में हर वीडियो का पीडीएफ हम लोग देते हैं तो व्हेन वी गिव दोस पीडीएफ तो कई स्टूडेंट बोलते हैं कि ठीक है पीडीएफ है तो फिर हम नोट्स नहीं बनाए सो आई ऑलवेज रिकमेंड की खुद बनाओ क्योंकि आप जब वीडियो देख रहे हो अगर आप लिख भी रहे हो तो आपको वहां पर याद हो रहा है अगर आप सिर्फ पैसिवली वीडियो देखोगे तो इट विल बी जस्ट लाइक अनदर पॉडकास्ट दैट यू आर वॉचिंग Of beer biceps ki, thik, aapko samaj to aega, maza to aega, exactly. ke, but yaad nahi hoga. And, exactly. uh, aapne, aapke book mein, aapke ek video mein aapne ek word tha, leisure leisure reading. Hmm. So, wo, it will be leisure listening na, ki, sunna hai, but conscious nahi hai. Uh, so handwritten notes are much better. 
much better right right so yeah. ek cheez yeah. jo uh, bhavish from your journey i can uh, understand is you made notes secondly uh, you revised those notes five times before you sat for the exam and uh, one thing that you explicitly mentioned ki kahin na kahin jo um, एक ऑर्डर है करेक्ट ऑर्डर है कि आप ब्रिटिश को प्रायोरिटाइज कर रहे हो फिर लिटरेरी क्रिटिसिज्म थियरी को कर रहे हो उस ऑर्डर को यू फॉलोड बिकॉज ब्रिटिश एज यू नो कितना भी कोई भी ऑल लिटरेचर आज ही मेरा शाम को वीडियो आने वाला है विच विल बी अबाउट डिसेबिलिटी लिटरेचर बिकॉज इन दिनों में एक आधा क्वेश्चन वहां से पूछा गया है सो कंसिडरिंग की बहुत सारे और टॉपिक्स भी एड हो रहे हैं इंग्लिश के अंदर बट तब भी एक जो मेजर चंक है वो हमेशा ब्रिटिश लिटरेचर का है एंड इट इज लाइक इंग्लिश एज अ लैंग्वेज हैज बीन बोर्न फ्रॉम ब्रिटेन सो यू कैन नॉट टेक आउट इंग्लिश ब्रिटिश लिटरेचर फ्रॉम इंग्लिश लिटरेचर इट इज गोइंग टू बी एन इंटीग्रल पार्ट एंड आई एम वेरी वेरी ग्लैड दैट यू यू रियली लिसन टू जो मेरा क्यू एन ए सेशन जूम पे हुआ था उसमें you were there you were actively listening you understood kuch cheeze and then you applied it so that was uh, something that i really feel ki uh, chalo uski wajah se kuch aapko aur ek better guidance mila so i'm very uh, happy to know that and i wish you all the best abhi to aage kafi lambi journey rehne wali hai and um, i really want ki you touch lives of so many other students and in the entire journey of being a lecturer or a professor you are able to really make a difference in the society through the way you teach literature because literature after all is teaching us to uh, create a better society hum jab bhi ye sari cheeze padhte hai diasporic literature hum uh, feminism padhte hai to un sab se kahin na kahin hamare ek soch mein badlav aata hai aur wahi badlav hum apne students ko dete so i really wish ki you become a very very phenomenal professor who touch the life of so many students and uh, wish you all the best and iske alawa is there any any other thing that you would want to talk about koi aisi tips that yes. you would want to give to students sure again uh, it is same from that june 2023 uh, i asked you one question in june 2023 ki when a session that uh, when what about chronology because it is difficult to arrange that uh, chapters and your answer worked well your answer was uh, ki bhavesh when i teach i teach in chronology for example if you are teaching um, any writer like william wordsworth when you are teaching you teach in chronology so if i at uh, uh, when i am sitting an exam and i remind myself ki arpita mam padha rahi thi arpita mam ne pehle ye padha tha fir ye padha tha fir ye padha tha maine jab revise kiya to pehle ye kiya pehle ye kiya ye kiya so in that reminding works so that was really helpful in chronology because i guess there were more than eight questions in in my attempt also no so exactly. if we uh, noted down we can rewind our mind ki pehle ye padha tha fir ye padha tha so that helps in chronology really well so that also worked your tip wow. that's that's great and i think chronology mein ye cheez mm-hmm. hai bhi ki आप इतने सारे डेट्स को ऐसे ही याद नहीं रख सकते हो मैं पूरे दिन अगर एक कॉपी लेके सिर्फ डेट्स भी याद करूं तो वो पॉसिबल नहीं है जब हम कोई राइटर को पढ़ रहे हैं और उसके सारे वर्क्स अगर हम उसी सीक्वेंस में लिखते हैं और उसी सीक्वेंस में हम उनके नोट्स बनाते हैं तो वो रिवाइज करते हुए ऑटोमेटिकली आपके दिमाग में सेट हो जाता है कि ये पेज पे यहाँ पे ये था इसके नीचे ये था इसके यहाँ पे ये था इसके यहाँ पे ये था एंड दैट इज हाउ वी रिमेम्बर इट ऑन द डे ऑफ द एग्जाम ऑल्सो सो दैट्स ग्रेट आई एम वेरी वेरी हैप्पी टू योर की मेरी यू हैव Applied so well. <laughs> hmm, I would say it's more than that. Hona chahiye the Q and A sessions. आप काफी कम लेते हैं मतलब we need more. Absolutely, absolutely. Yeah. I'll try to. अभी तो from the past four five months I was busy writing paper one का book. Uh, so उसने मेरा काफी मतलब because uh, that was a very very intensive project. I had to write from the scratch. So it took uh, me sixteen seventeen hours of writing yeah. for. Four, five months constantly. This me, no Saturday, Sunday break, nahi tha. Uh, so that I could wow. release wow. that book on time because I wanted to give that book for students who are preparing for December. So, unke liye aa jaye, pehle hi aa jaye because uh, us book ko bhi matlab uh, maine isi tarah se design kiya ki 33 days me aap cover kar sakte. So, wo ek time mere oh. dimag me tha ki 33 days uh, student ke pas. हो अगर ये बुक आ जाए तब तक तो वो 33 डेज में रोज एक 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 चैप्टर करके ही बी एबल टू फिनिश दैट सो दैट टुक अ लॉट ऑफ टाइम सो इस वजह से आई कुड नॉट टेक अ लॉट ऑफ सेशंस बट आई वुड डेफिनेटली ट्राई एंड टेक मोर सच क्यू एन ए सेशन ग्रेट ग्रेट चलिए थैंक यू सो मच भावेश इट्स लवली इंटरेक्टिंग विथ यू एंड विश यू ऑल द बेस्ट 
एंड स्टे इन टच कोई भी हेल्प चाहिए हो कभी भी कुछ ऐसा लगे कि लिटरेचर में कहीं पे अटक रहे हो एंड यू रियली वॉन्ट माई यू नो माई टेक ऑन इट आई बी मोर देन हैप्पी टू हेल्प यू Absolutely. Great, great. Okay. Thank you so Thank much, Bhavesh. Bye-bye. Bye. Good day. Good day. Yeah. Good day to you too. Bye.